Hello, and welcome to this quick introduction to the Wazer Desktop Waterjet Cutter. Before we get started with the hardware, I'd like to get you up to speed on why Wazer exists and also probably why you're here. The team at Wazer found that there was a demand in the market for a solution to produce parts in metal that was cost effective and quick to produce. We all know that there's flexibility of plastic um, 3D printers out there which produce parts very quickly. However, they often struggle when it comes to mechanical properties. This is where Wazer comes in. With its compact size and easy to use nature, we've cut super soft materials such as silicon all the way to super hard materials like titanium. And Wazer takes it all in its stride. Today, I'm gonna to show you how we can produce a simple aluminum cog, taking it from the CAD step all the way through to a physical metal part. Now I'm gonna give you a quick tour around the machine and get cutting this part. Wazer will work with almost any 2D or 3D CAD package. For this example, you can see we're using SolidWorks. You simply just need to be able to export a DXF or DVG file. As you can see here, we're just gonna open up the DXF we've just saved out, position it in the bottom left-hand corner where is where I've installed our stock material. We've also got some tools here to scale and reposition. Um, any files that you've loaded in if needed. We're going to pick our material. For this one we're doing aluminium 606 at 3mm thick. We'll pick that from the list. We're then going to choose outside cut path and we're going to turn off the automatically generated tabs for this instance, um, just for the demo. Once we've done that, we can then export this file and give it a name and then head, head over to the Wazer to get cutting. Thank you for watching this walkthrough of the Wazer. If you'd like to find out more, feel free to head over to our website or reach out to one of our sales guys for an on-site or virtual demo. Thanks very much, see you soon.